Um, hey girls, it's Friday, and I'm sorry, but there's going to be a direct upload, because my camera is being shitty, and I hate it, and I'm sorry, um, but I am exhausted. I have spent every night this week auditioning for the school musical for 2nd Street. Um, I'm, I'm so tired. I got, like, no sleep last night, and, um, today was the first read-through, and I am a featured singer, uh, and I'm also having some dance parts, which, you know, is good, because I've been tapping for seven years with an all tap show, so, you know, that's always good. Um, this week is boy week, and, um, I was at the assembly with Katie, so I, 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 I knew what it's all about, um, there, there was one part of it where they had people, they had, there was an open mic. So you come out and talk about your experience with bullying. Or, I don't want to call it bullying, because bullying has been so overused, it doesn't even mean bullying anymore. So, I'm just going to call it, um, I don't know, I'll call it being cool to someone. So, just as I was getting, mustering up the courage, to go up and tell my story, the woman who was running it told us that there was no more time and that no one else could come up. I was crushed, but it happened, it's life. <coughs> so I'm going to tell you it now. Um, well, I've been bullied my whole life. It's a sad fact, but it, it's true. Um, one of the first things I can remember is fourth grade. Um, there was this boy I had been in class with for three other years. Um, it was our four, it was our fourth year together. Um, and he was making it his like mission to make my life miserable. Uh, I was pretty big back then, so he would make comments about my weight. He would make comments about the way I dressed, the, the people I hung out with. Um, call me names, call my friends names, and soon it was just, it was too much to handle, um, and by fifth grade, I had no friends, really, um, it was a pretty low point, and it was around that time when my dad left for Iraq, so it was just like a, a wave of emotion. And, um, my grades started to slip, and I started to act out, and it was, it was really, a really bad time for everything. So, um, it was, it was, um, one of the hardest times I've had to go through. I had, um, no self-esteem left. I, I felt worthless and horrible for myself. And the only way I made it through it was... In sixth grade, I met some fantastic friends who are still my friends today. And without them, I really don't know what I would do. I don't know where I would be right now. Um, so really what I'm trying to say is be nice to people. You can change someone. Truthfully, I'm still trying to get through. I'm still trying to get over that time. I'm still trying to gain up confidence. I'm still trying to trust people, really, um, and if it wasn't for the friends I made, I don't, I don't think I would have been nearly as secure with myself as I am right now, but, um, yeah, so, what I'm trying to say is, you never, ever pick on, pick on people, um, I'm not, it's, it's so hard to talk. Speaking is hard, um, really just watch what you say. You don't know how it will affect people. Different people affect, mm, different people get affected by different things, and you can't just assume that they're not going to take it too, very, very hard. Um, so be careful what you say, be a friend, be an ally, be the change. Okay, bye girls.